the Arizona State game and the Illinois game, from, from ex my, my experience, is those have been the two most diff challenging games of the year, psychologically. We last saw the Florida A&M men's basketball team in action 10 days ago, and since then the Rattlers have had to endure two game cancellations that would have provided a last minute tune up for their inaugural season in the SWAC conference. FAMU head coach Robert McCollum spoke with ABC 27 about this the last two weeks first program. Losing the games right before and right after the Christmas holiday is just a part of the trend happening right now with collegiate athletics and COVID-19, but it took a toll on his guys mentally. A few of his players even lost some opportunities to play in games right in their own hometowns. But with so much uncertainty ahead regarding conference play in the postseason due to the pandemic, McCollum says his team is prepared to take these new challenges day by day and hope for the best. The impact is so great that it it would be unfair or it's just unrealistic to think that every time a team can't play, it's got to count as a loss. And so uh, we're waiting to, to see what, uh, if, if the SWAG maintains its current stance that if a team can't play with count of the nail, or if they go, go back, take a look at it, and say we'll try and reschedule those games. So, so that's, where we, that's where we are now. FAMU will play Bethune-Cookman in its SWAG opener on January 3rd.